Transitioning into the fall and winter season means you have the perfect excuse to buy cute winter shoes. It's a crazy mess right now because we were gone for almost like a month and I just never had the chance to clean up. Oh my dog's bark box is here. It's so cute. It's a little turkey. Turkey burger. And are these curly fries? Can't wait to show her her little toys when she comes back. What is this? <gasps> it's dog! Look! Turkey burger! So we're going to go see Blackpink's concert today and since it's pretty far from where we live, we are going to stay one night at the Conrad Hotel in DTLA. I'm just packing a few things right now and finally putting my duffel bag to use. Hello room! The Conrad in DTLA is a newly built hotel, I think. This is the most basic room, I assume, but it's still pretty nice. Everything is so new and I love the wooden accents and the way they designed the bathroom to be somewhat connected to the main bedroom. How work? Oh! Finally got done ready and this is my outfit for tonight. We're on our way to the Blackpink concert.
in two days it's thanksgiving and every year i spend thanksgiving with my boyfriend side of the family and i'm always responsible for making the charcuterie boards so this is what i made last year and not to toot my own horn i feel like the board i made was pretty damn nice <laughs> so i don't know how i'm gonna top that and i actually didn't even make a grocery list of things because this year's just so rushed but i'm just gonna wing it and see what they have in store I'm currently at a supermarket called Gelson's. I love this place because they have really high quality items at a reasonable price, unlike Whole Foods. <laughs> they also have a huge section dedicated to your charcuterie board needs. They have some cool stuff that other average supermarkets don't have such as pure natural honeycomb. Like, I don't see this in Elberson's, I don't think. I also love these little toasts for your meats and cheeses. And this fig almond cake is also super bomb. I also stumbled upon an adorable little holiday gift section, but I'm having a very uneducated moment. Can someone explain what a marzipan is to me? I briefly googled it, but still doesn't answer my question, so I'm just gonna buy one and try it. I'm buying some chocolate covered raisins, cherries, and almonds by weight so I can decide how much I want. Also, filming in public is low key awkward sometimes. Like, I feel like a freak, but you gotta do what you gotta do, man. always love looking at the grocery store flowers <laughs> i honestly wish there are bodegas in southern california that sells bouquets on the streets like new york city does okie dokie i think i'm ready to check out so i know i look like a complete bomb right now but it's so cold in the house before i turn on my camera i was contemplating on changing into something cute but it was just way too cold so i was like you know what fuck it i'm just gonna be real and show up as is but yeah so i'm currently in my closet right now as you can see uh, because I'm going to Miami in two days um, and since tomorrow is Thanksgiving I have a full day of commitments hi baby so I won't be able, I won't have time to pack so that's why I want to start early um, but yeah I just thought it would be really fun if I just briefly show you guys what I'm gonna be bringing with me to Miami. I actually did not plan out any outfits or anything, but I heard that Miami is pretty warm, so I'm super excited to whip out my dresses and summer clothing again. Yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. So my closet is a complete mess right now. I never got the time to clean and reorganize. So please don't judge me. So I think Miami fashion is super colorful and just very all out glam. So I'm gonna pick a couple of dresses I have from here that I feel would be suitable. So um, I guess the first dress I wanna bring is this like Barbie core color maxi dress. It is so wrinkly. I'm gonna have to iron it. And then the second one, I'm also going to bring maxi dress. It's a little bit more on the casual side. Full pink satin dress with a very cute, like, glittery, what do you call this? Rip, uh, a glittery outlining. 
It's a long dress as well. Since we have a couple of very important events with um, AP, which is the watch brand, and also uh, Art Basel, I want to bring like more formal dresses that I can wear. Um, like formal dresses that are not super like slutty. <laughs> Obviously, I have to iron this. It's from Opali. But I love this little, it's like a kind of little off the shoulder uh, midi dress and I love the screen. I just feel like the screen is so pretty. I'm gonna bring another dress that's in the same green color but it's a two-piece. So this is the top which is a little corset with rhinestones and this is the skirt for it. There's like a little slit in the back, which is super cute. High five. Good girl. Other hand. Good girl. I'm also going to bring some beach cover ups. Have one in the cream color. And I have another one in white. I think this will be perfect for the Miami vibes. And I'm also going to bring oh this dress as well blue dress okay so i'm just gonna quickly fold my clothes and put them in the luggage For the past seven years, I've always been away from my family during Thanksgiving holiday and I am lucky enough to be able to spend it with my boyfriend's family, but whether you are alone, you are working, or you have company this holiday, you are loved and I'm thankful that you are here. Maybe it's the long nights and the short 